Hi everyone, welcome to Story Cafe. Today's story is called Peter Digs a Den. And I chose this story because it's about a real little boy who really did dig a den. And also this little boy is from Cumbria. Peter lived in a cottage at the foot of Old Man with his mother, his brothers, his dad and his gran, his sister, the cat, the dog and the goats. He liked climbing trees to watch sailing boats. One sunny day as he sat in the trees an idea came blowing across on the breeze. Though Peter was small, his idea was big. He decided that day a den he would dig. In a shop that sold tackle and odd bits and bobs, Peter found a small spade just fit for the job. A fold-away spade in a dull army green. Ta-da! The best looking spade that he had ever seen. But he had no money, not a penny or pound. So he set off back home. Some work must be found. He hung out the laundry. He fixed up the boats. Looked after his brother, walked the dog and the goats. He worked very hard and he saved and he saved. With the money he made, he bought that green spade. On a wet windy day, when rain soaked the earth, Peter made his first cut with his spade in the turf. He dug and he dug and he dug up the ground and the soil that he dug, he piled in a mound. Then he dug and he dug and he dug up some more till he dug out the walls and he dug up the floor. When the den was all dug, there was no left to dig. So he fashioned a roof from some branches and twigs. He broke up the bracken, he bashed up the brash, bundled up sycamore, hazel and ash. All done, he walked back to the foot of old man. And he called to his mother, his brothers, his gran, his sister, his dad, the dog, goat and cat, pointed down to his den and said, Look at that! I did it, he cried. It took hours and hours of digging and digging. Look, that den is ours. It was dark, it was damp, with a dank, earthy stink. Peter looked at his family, asked, What do you think? His mother said, Great! Grand, said his dad. His sister cried, Wow! Gran muttered, Not bad. They thanked little Peter and wished him good night. Then all slept in that den under stars and moonlight.